East of Eden, um, this film released in 1955, directed by Elliot Zan, based off of a 1952 novel by John Steinbeck. Only a small part of John Steinbeck's East of Eden has been used in the motion picture version of it that Elia Kazan has done, and it is questionable whether the part, part contains the best of the book. It is the part that has to do with the conflict between the farmer, Antras, and Cal. His son, his son, the one who is obsessed with a sense of badness and jealousy towards his brother, whom his father loves. It also contains the later details of the career of the monstrous mother of the boys, and the story of the sweetheart of Brother Aaron who forsakes him for the more exciting Cal. I really enjoyed James Dean's acting. What are you laughing? Shut up. <laughs> I really enjoyed uh, James Dean's acting because in the movie he plays this shy, disturbed teen. And the reason why he's like this is because he didn't receive as much love and affection from his father as his brother Aaron did. You forgot the names? Just keep it going. Okay. <laughs> Just okay. Yeah. Uh, so, and also his mother had <coughs> left them, and they had no idea that she was even still alive. So, that's one thing. Also, I really liked um, James Dean's progression from being this shy, disturbed teenager to being more outgoing in the end. Uh, because, you know, in the end, he, like, just didn't really care anymore, and he... He eventually even got the girl at the end. And this was sort of because he had a, this sort of mental breakdown because his dad, he had started this uh, business because his dad business went under. So he tried to find a way to make money. Yeah, which led to, which led him, led, like, led him talked to his mother, which involved her in getting money, which basically made it a no-no with his dad. So, so he started this business and he gave his dad the money for his birthday, but the dad didn't accept it, which made Cal sort of have a rage. He was like rage, yeah. more or less rage. Yeah. And then he went uh, as far as taking Aaron to the brothel that his mother was working at and revealed... Uh, his mother to Aaron, which then made Aaron sort of go insane and go fight in this war that he didn't want to really take part in. And uh, as we, um, besides the storyline and what going on, whatnot like that, the actors which played these uh, these roles were um, are. <clears throat> uh, or are Julie Harris as um, Abram, uh, James Dean as Cal, uh, Cal Trask, Raymond uh, Massey as Adam, Ta Adam Trask, uh, Richard Richard Davidos as Aaron Trask, um, Joe Van Van Joe Van well, Joe Van Cleet as uh, Kane, uh, Kate Trask. The production of the film moves um, to some of the early, early 20th century uh, in Monterey, California, but much of it was actually shot in um, Mendocino, California. You know, some of the scenes were filmed in the Salinas Valley, California. I feel like, um, I really like, uh, you know, James Dean. You know, this is really his, the film that really, you know, brought him you know, basically started, you know, his career. You know, he was starting a couple of films before, but this one was a film that really, you know, basically gave him the start, you know, and really, he really influenced the whole 50s generation, you know, he was really an icon and influenced the whole greaser look, and, you know, in his, his movies, you know. Yeah, and adding to, adding, adding to Rick's, Rick's, Rick's sign also here, um, yeah, uh, Rick, James Dean was actually preferably more known 
uh, with his with his friends friends and like family uh, as Jimmy for some Jimmy James James came James came afterwards because of Hollywood went out but closely um, it was Jimmy <laughs> like it was it was Jimmy like they would literally call him Jim or Jim and but besides that uh, his acting his acting in general was actually focus on basically himself because he, he actually had a tragedy in the past and through this movie through this movie he actually uh, put his energy in it and became an icon while passing his feelings you know expressing it through acting and um, acting and physical and fix and physical acting or not for, for real <laughs> for real. Which which later on led to his accidents with the with the vehicle with yeah, like the like haunted five, vehicle five six months later after the yes. film was released yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. as a, as a, my my team was saying to, uh, um <clears throat> after this movie he was killed hmm? after uh, like five uh, six months after the movie was released you know yeah so and to add all right <laughs> cool. Thank you very much. This was the interview of East Vienna. I'm Francisco Rojas. I'm uh, Ricky Solis and Christopher Ortiz. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you.